Valladolid, officially the municipality of Valladolid, is a fourth-class municipality in the province of Negros Occidental, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 37,833 people, known as the Food Basket of Negros Occidental. The municipality celebrates its fiesta every 28 February. Geography Valladolid Municipality is located on the southwestern coast of the province of Negros Occidental. It is approximately 31 kilometers 19 miles south of Bacolod City, a 35-minute drive by private car or 45 minutes by public utility vehicles via the main highway. Valladolid is bounded on the north by the town of Pulapandan, on the south by the municipality of San Enrique, on the west by the Guimaras Strait and on the east by the city of La Carlota. The global location of municipality of Valladolid is 10 degrees, 27 minutes 54 seconds, north and 122 degrees 49 minutes 33.6 seconds, east with Our Lady of Guadalupe Church as the benchmark. Valladolid has two pronounced seasons, wet and dry. The rainy season starts from May to January of the following year with heavy rains occurring during the months of August and September. Dry season starts from the month of February until the last week of April. Barangays Valladolid is geographically subdivided into 16 barangays. History the place was first called Inabuyan until the Spanish leaders arrived and one of them named the place after his native town Valladolid in Spain. During the Spanish era, Valladolid was considered one of the most prosperous towns of Negros Occidental. The size of the convent and church built by the Recollect missionaries in 1851 were proofs of this status considering that the church authorities were powerful in running the affairs of the government. Valladolid was established in 1860. The influx of settlers from the neighboring islands of Guimaras, Panay and Cebu prompted the then-governor Saravia to create an additional town which is now Pulapandan. The settlers made this town a landing area in coming to Negros, brought about by the introduction of sugar which resulted in the economic growth and prosperity of the island. The town is known as the rice granary of Negros Occidental with 90% of its arable land planted to Pele. It produces more than half a million cabins of rice every year. It also produces vegetables, fruits and the dewal or angel wings shell, a seasonal delicacy. The Aetis were the original inhabitants of Valladolid. They were ultimately forced to move to the uplands when the early settlers and colonizers came to stay. Significant events in the province during the early founding years as well as major upheavals during and after the revolutionary period brought profound changes in the municipality. By and large, Valladolid has its place in the historical setup of the province of Negros Occidental socially, spiritually, economically and politically. It is also the bulwark of Filipinistas Aglipayan and Negros. This dominant sect caused the defeat of the fiery Manuel L. Quezon in the hands of the Aglipayans in the presidential election of 1935 during the Commonwealth era. Pasundayag Festival is a thanksgiving and celebration of good harvest. It is a farmer's festival in honor of the town's patroness, Nuestra Señora de Guadalupe featuring street dancing competition, arena festival dance showdown and merry-making. In 1957, Sitio Paloma was converted into a barrio. Demographics Religion Philippine Independent Church majority of the population of the town are followers of the Aglipayan faith. Roman Catholic Church Education Primary level Secondary level Francisco Infante Memorial High School Tabao National High School Tabao National High School Lockeran Extension Valladolid National High School Valladolid National High School Ayangon Extension Resources and Economy 
Water Clean and safe water supply provided by Valladolid Water District, Power Abundant power supply provided by NOCECO Attractions Our Lady of Guadalupe Church, Our Lady of Guadalupe Church was founded in 1851 by the Recollect missionaries and reputed to be the biggest in the province. The size of the church and convent is a living proof that Valladolid stood among the island's most progressive pueblos during the Spanish era. Belay Dolid, Valladolid Community Museum, Belay Dolid, Valladolid Community Museum, is one of the ancestral houses in town owned by the Icolina family. The Valladolid Community Museum features the rich cultural heritage of the town. Sunset Boulevard, it is a perfect place to watch the beautiful sunset along the Guimaras Strait. A good venue to commune with nature is the water laps along the seawall. Century-old Acacia Haven, 32 acacia trees surround the public plaza and provide shade to all passers. It was planted by Icolina, the first town official. Relic of an 18th-century graveyard, this resting place was solely intended for the illustrados or the rich member of the community during that time. The area is about 3 hectares surrounded by coral reef stones giving the place a classic effect. Fruit stand by the highway, situated at the highway of Brigi. Palaka, travelers pass by this area displaying mangoes, watermelon, fruit jams and other exotic delicacies. Highway Food Park, located along the highway between Brigi. Palaka and Crossing Pakal, this food park is composed of stalls serving breakfast, lunch and dinner. Menu varies from meat, vegetables to fresh seafood. Tavao Fish Terminal Food Court, Tavao Fish Terminal Food Court at Brigi. Central Tavao Fish Terminal opens at 11 p.m. to 5 a.m. Offers grilled fish, tanola and quinoa. Also serves coffee with native IBUs or suman. Tavao Weavers Association, TWA, Display Center, at Brigi. Central Tavao offers hand-woven products ideal for souvenir. References External links Philippine Standard Geographic Code Philippine Census Information Local Governance Performance Management System